Well, the players are welcomed out of the tunnel here at Loughborough University Stadium. West Ham in their famous claret and blue. Liverpool in their chain strip this afternoon. It's West Ham's final pre-season fixture that isn't behind closed doors ahead of the new WSL season. And it's a really tough start for the Hammers as well. Away to Chelsea, which is certainly one that many will be keeping an eye on for Liverpool. They'll be away to Reading in their first league match of the season. These two sides who met in Liverpool's last season in the WSL before they were relegated a couple of years ago. West Ham winning 4-2 in the last competitive meeting between the sides. Nick turn from Cairns and finds Roberts. Ander Sandon gives chase and finds Stengel too. Sissoko got a foot in. An opportunity for Liverpool and a brilliant save. Mackenzie Arnold getting down and saving with her feet. It was heading towards the far corner. Ball breaks here for Kaivag. Driving on. Smith to her left. They will try and keep it in play on the byline. It's not a bad delivery to the far post either. Volleyed back across goal and wide. Really good technique on the effort. Yep. Shirt tug and advantage with Liverpool as Van der Sanden comes forward. Now operating on the left-hand side as Lawley peels wide. Dangerous cross and the opening goal for Liverpool. Headed in by Casey Stengel, the American forward. It was a dangerous cross from Lawley. Stengel got up and planted a header down into the far right corner. Beyond the reach of Arnold. And moments after West Ham could have taken the lead at one end through Zoo, Liverpool opened the scoring at the other. Yeah, no, it just shows you how quick football can change. We had a chance to score there that one minute before they've scored. And yeah, a really good cross into the box and a great hit from Katie Stengel. One back by Hasegawa, helps on towards Asai. Still in possession, the French midfielder. Let's take a shot on here. It's not a bad effort either. Didn't get quite a curl on it. Vivian Asai. Hasegawa's corner. Headed towards goal and flicked onto the crossbar in the end. It's a scramble and Liverpool deal with it. It's another West Ham corner. Good ball out to Smith on the near side. Picked off by Coivisto. Now Van der Sanden returning it to Coivisto. And now Stengel denied by Arnold. She made a really good save about this time in the first half, about a minute and a half, two minutes in with her feet. And that was a good stop to deny Stengel what would have been a second of the game. For that, that, for no. that fact, and she, she can throw it so, so far. Lawley's ball towards the far post and Van der Sanden's there to score. Lurking at the far post, the Dutch winger. Lawley's delivery, as it was in the first half for Stengel, pinpoint. And van der Sanden free at the far post. To nod home from just a couple of yards out. Liverpool, who have started the second half pretty well, have doubled their advantage. Yeah, I mean, I don't think it's undeserved either. I think they've started the second half much stronger than what we, we've come out the block. And step Zoo, and it was Campbell who won that 50-50. Looking for Kiernan as well. And Sissoko's challenge, it's a penalty. Well, I have to say from here, that looked quite harsh. A lot of you won the ball, Sissoko. It's Kiernan, it's saved by Arnold, but the rebound goes in from Leanne Kiernan. Who notches against her former club. Good stop down to her right from Arnold, who guessed correctly. But Leanne Kiernan alert to turn in the rebound, slamming high into the roof of the net. As Phyllis brings it down. Here come Liverpool with Holland, away from Longhurst, and gets a cross in towards Kiernan. 4-0 to Liverpool. 
Leon Kiernan, second, coming off the bench. It was a good run towards the byline from Kerry Holland. Pulled it back for Kiernan, who swept it into the bottom corner off her left foot. West Ham just caught out on this near side and trying to play their way forward. And Holland did well getting to the byline. A flick around the corner is a neat one from Humphrey. And Campbell's away down the left. Looking for Daniels. It's beyond her and picked up by Coivisto. Away from Atkinson. Options in the centre. One of them's Kiernan. And Kiernan completes her hat trick. Again, it's the ball in from a wide area. Kiernan showing good movement inside the penalty area once again. And an emphatic finish from the Irish forward.